Hi guys, before we get the video started, a quick note about the gameplay. This is going to be up against bots. I wanted to try and show you guys some gameplay of me flying in the helicopter with the special reaper on this map. However, that didn't quite work out in game. Every time I came up with the map behemoth, people didn't want to play it. So that just goes to show you how popular it is. But anyway, uh, I just wanted to be a little bit transparent with you guys. I'm not trying to pretend this is such a beast gameplay or whatever. I just want to show you guys uh, the helicopter ride area special care package reaper thing so anyway let's get started with the review good morning you beautiful people i hope you guys are having a wonderful day today welcome back to another episode of my call of duty ghost dlc map review this time we are reviewing behemoth Behemoth is the worst map in this map pack without a shadow of a doubt. It is a three lane map and it is incredibly cramped. You are playing, it's a really cool place to be. You're playing on this like digging crane thing in the middle of this dig site and it's a really cool atmospheric place to be but I really, really dislike it. It's so cramped, there's not a lot of flank routes, there's not a lot of places to go. Uh, light containment, this is probably the most like a Black Ops 2 map in such a way that there's really a spawn trap to be set up and there is not a lot of good strategic things you can do in this map. Like I said before, there is a very easy spawn trap to be set up. A is on the top level of the map, B is on the middle level of the map, and C is on the bottom level of the map. So, as you would imagine, if you have A and B, you can easily just sit there and camp people coming from C. Because it is a three lane map, these spawns are horrendous. They are pretty much unflippable. If you have an enemy in your own spawn, you will continue to spawn there as, as long as your teammates are there if uh, the only way to flip a spawn is to get you and maybe two or three of your teammates to go up and kill everybody in the enemy spawn and I mean everybody in the enemy spawn and get you guys spawning there it takes so much to flip spawns on this map, especially in Domination. It is very, very unbalanced. There's not a, a lot of good flank routes like I've said before. It is just a bad map for maneuvering. Uh, if you want to be successful on this map, go at the pace your enemies are. If you are being spawn trapped at sea, stop running at them. Stop approaching them. Let them come to you. Let them get curious. Let them get bored. Use a C4. Use recon. And as you'll see in one of my previous videos beasting on behemoth um, uh, I use a bulldog class this is for a class that's probably more kill confirmed or team deathmatch oriented uh, it's a very good class for this map this map is you can get away with shotguns pretty effectively you can get away with even light machine guns and sniper rifles there's a pretty good amount of sight lines on this map it's really good for any gun I will say you're gonna struggle with the sniper rifles and the shotguns but it's not impossible and it's if you're trying you can probably do it very effectively the special care package, the Reaper on this map, is a minigun with a helicopter. You can fly around in a minigun and you can uh, just shoot people from the top. This is probably the least effective uh, Reaper we've ever seen. Even some of the uh, air strikes or missile strikes like on Siege is more effective than this. Uh, the hit detection, the hit boxes as you're up in the helicopter, the random hip fire spread of the minigun, you are not going to get a kill. I got this care package probably once in game and uh, a couple times playing against bots and it is the most ridiculous terrible thing uh, i like the presentation like i've said before on these videos i enjoy the creativity they have i like the kind of uh, thing they're going for but it's poor execution and i just don't like it it's not very good so that is what i think of behemoth uh, it's not a bad map like when we play it i definitely don't want to play it but it's not something like siege where you have to endure it the pacing is going to be a little bit faster than like stonehaven or or a slow map it's a good pace of the map but it's just very very unbalanced and so that's what i think of that what do you guys think of behemoth what do you guys think uh, is your strategy on behemoth do you like it do you not like it and uh thank you guys so much for watching until the next absolutely beautiful call of duty morning i'll catch up with you guys later and as always have a great day